Okay, so last time y'all saw me. Sorry, okay. I'm looking wretched. You know, my hair is not, you know, in the best state because like a few, like half an hour ago, I just woke up. So I'm just going to turn the camera on, okay? Okay. So, yes. I got a new fridge. I got a new fridge. Because the last one that I had, the freezing wasn't working properly. So I had to get a new fridge. And here it is. And yeah, they just delivered it like this. They told me that, yeah, I have to unpack it myself, you know, due to Corona, due, due to COVID. And first I have to, you know, I have to unpack it right now, let it sit for 24 hours and then I can turn it on. So yeah, luckily I don't have, I didn't have so much things in my fridge. So nothing will be going to waste, so yeah we're going to wait i'm going to unpack it in a minute wait i'm just going to finish eating and then i'm going to unpack it so i'll do a time lapse or some some damn damn okay Is it normal that you shouldn't be touching the fridge when you unpack it? Because... I got electrocuted by the fridge! And I have to move it because it's in the way! I should have known better. Let me Google that shit. Let me Google that shit. So, um, I managed to put the fridge in the corner where it's supposed to go. I just put on the cardboard on the fridge and push it back here. So, yeah. And I don't know why. I did my research on Google and didn't find a certain reason why it, I'm getting electrocuted. But I didn't feel like, you know, the spark anymore. I didn't feel the shock anymore when I moved it and also there was like something right here that you know just to keep the door closed I peeled that off and it didn't shock me so I don't know what went wrong by the way don't, again don't mind the hair okay don't mind the hair I'm still in my natural habitat okay 
but i'm going to open it so we can see the inside together but i'm going to use this because never know if i'm going to get electrocuted so um they told me when they brought it they told me that i have to wait 24 hours so obviously i'm going to wait 24 hours so today we're going to get something i think thais bazaar i don't feel like you know dressing up and going outside to eat so i think we're going to thais bazaar something delicious because we can't cook we don't have nothing so ciao anyway um let's open this baby up um so here we go this is it i hope y'all can see so obviously here on the shelf we have a lot more space if i notice immediately the other one the shelf on the side was a little bit smaller and it couldn't fit so much things i have a bottle of something let me grab a bottle of something so i can show y'all so i'm just going to put this here wait wait <laughs> i'm just going to put it yeah so i have more <coughs> damn wow yeah so definitely i have more space because in the other fridge i could fit only three bottles on the shelf and i think i could fit four and i also have a little bit more space if i push it a little bit more in the back so definitely we have a little bit more space so that's a good thing to start off and yeah the other the other one also had three shops so yeah um what else i have two shelves and also a bin i'm not going to open it because you know i don't know what's about to happen let me bring y'all up close to the baby wait let me situate y'all a little bit more comfortable let me situate you a little bit more comfortable okay so now we have a better view wait wait okay now we have a better view so these are the side shelves this is it do you see let me put the bottle again wait oh my gosh i'm being so all over the place with this shit but okay i'm gonna put the bottle here and i'm just going to lower it so here is the bottle do you see the space that i was talking about wait do you see it around so yes i think i can up stack up to four to five bottles on the side so that's a good thing and also i the space here i have literally i can put higher bottles wait i have a higher bottle i guess i think this is higher no it's the same not just a little bit higher just but wait i think i can fit more than four or no i think it's four yeah four to five that's really great that's really great so definitely an upgrade by the side of the shelves and my bin here is bigger than the other one so also that's a good thing this one i can reposition it and make it go a little bit higher up here so that's also really good and it's bigger i have like a little bit more space so i'm happy with that and let's check the freezer together the freezer i think will be the same size as the other one but the good thing about this is it has like a door handle. The other one didn't have like a door handle. So, whack. Really whack. Oh, and also here I can, you know, put the temperature thing. And also I have a lighting in the corner there. So, yeah. Let's open this baby up. How do you open this? Just push it? Yeah, okay. 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 So, this is the freezer. Um, This freezer is a little just just a tiny bit more bigger than the other one that i had so it's like this i'm so happy with this fridge so so happy it def it's definitely an upgrade from the other one so fridge door it is <laughs>
Kidoki Gogo fam. So, um, I just wanted to show y'all something real quick. So, don't mind the mess in my room because right now it's a little bit messy because, you know, I had to clear out the fridge. And also, I'm collecting all my water bottles and all of the different bottles. So, I had to put them in a sack because they was firstly situated right at the side of my previous fridge but yeah i have to find a new place and also i did the laundry so i have the bags with all the clothes that i didn't fold yet so cook with your sis because we're going there step by step okay don't watch the mess but watch the things that i'm going to show you okay don't judge don't don't, don't do it don't do it okay because i cannot be perfect all the time so um this table um it's right now my dining table but i want to um put this over here and replace my mirror in another corner i don't know where yet because yeah i didn't figure it out yet but i want to put that table here but i'm not going to place it like that i'm just going to push it right at my um wall so it can be horizontal do you call that horizontal yeah so i don't want it to be poking out like that but the other side around and i will be situating both um chairs on the same side and right above it just imagine it okay right above it i'm going to put a mirror i guess and of course this is going to be painted this color this is going to move um i don't know where yet so this is going to move and also the mirror is going to move the fan can st stay um stay there um the whole hustle and tassel there also is going to move with a mirror and i will place my sofa right here and this area this mirror that you see right here is going in the entryway and uh, this area will be for the television and uh, yeah so help us is out to where i can put my clothing rack and the mirror because i don't know maybe on this side but imagine the um television is going to go here already so i don't know maybe on the end there I don't know i'm trying to figure that still out so let me know in the comment section below what you think and what other possibilities are out there so i can you know I rearrange everything in the house and also another update i have finally curtains um i wanted to hang that curtain right up there but i still didn't put a curtain rod and low-key i like it there so i think i will be leaving it there and my see-through um, curtains are just in the corner so when i open it up i can open it up like this they will still in the corner like that or if i want i can just pull these right in the center oh, wait so you can get the image okay so i did it like you know real quick just for a little bit of lighting to come through you know i can play around with it i don't really like it like this but you know we will see maybe i can change my mind and just get rid of these and just put two more curtains of this one at the end so yeah because lately i've been liking my um room a little bit you know dark so yeah and also i order food so let me show you a real quick what i order i ordered at lung fung i think you pronounce it like that i don't know but it's a moximati and if you wonder what a moximati is i'm going to show you wait i'm just going to situate everything and then i'll show you because it's already a mess in here So this is the famous moximati that I was talking about. Um, it comes with noodles and this is a um, mix of meat, pork and chicken. 
and this is the sauce that's supposed to go with the noodles and by every order you get one uh, sack of i think you get like 10 pieces of these um spring rolls so that's really cute it's also vegetarian so but if you're a vegetarian of course you ain't going to order this but if you order at lung Fung, i think there will be other options for my veggie persons okay so i'm going to split this in two because i won't be able to um eat all of this in one day so i'll be eating this in two separate days and i also grabbed a bowl and a fork so i can grab half of the noodles put it in here put my sauce and you know serve it but yeah this is a must try it's super delicious if you live in the netherlands or i don't know where other parts of the world they also serve this i think in um suriname or something like that they also serve this because i think it's a suriname dish i'm not sure or is it chinese i think it's more of suriname dish i don't know Correct me if I'm wrong, but this is so, so good. Since I tried this, I couldn't resist it anymore. This is so good. So I, I'm going, I'm going to dig in my food. And maybe I'll do a little snippet, you know. You know. Eating my food. 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 Wow, Coco. Let me grab my water because I also ordered coconut water with my order, but I this says roasted coconut juice and I don't like that. No, I just want some basic coconut water. I don't want no roasted, burnt, none of that shit. So yeah, unfortunately I won't be drinking that. So I will be doing this, I will be eating this with water. This is the small plate. So if you want to order the large one <laughs> make sure that you're going to serve this make sure that you eat a lot or you're going to serve with another person or with two other persons because by yourself you can't eat that if you eat a lot if you eat a lot then probably yeah but if not then it will be more than enough for two days this is it close up looks really yummy and It's super yummy. I love it. Oh, and then I'm going to show you the chicken. This is the chicken. It's just roasted chicken. Mm, oh my god. That's so good. Mm -mm. Amazing. Just amazing. I'm grabbing a package at a shop right close to my house um this package was completely lost and all of a sudden i got this at home that they delivered it at a shop for me so i'm going to grab it right now but on the thing it stated that they delivered it on the 8th of september and right now we are at the end of september so i don't know if they still have it so I'll update y'all in a few minutes if I got it, if they found it, what happened to the package, etc, etc. Update. Um, they don't have the package there. So right now I have to contact Pastanel back for my package and see where it is lingering around. Um, hopefully I get it back because this is a collaboration package it's a collaboration package like i don't want to go back and forth with the brand about the whole package it's, it will seems like i received their package and you know i don't want to do the collaboration but it's lost so anyway right now i'm heading back home and see what i can fix and we got it on okay i think it's flickering because right now it's going to you know i just turned it on it's been 24 hours i just turned it on and it's going to you know get cold right now but before it gets super cold i'm going to just clean it 
and i also decided to keep this because it's too heavy only for me to lift it up to get rid of this so and i don't want to get electrocuted again so hell to the no it's going to stay here it doesn't bother me at all so yeah um yeah so we're going to clean this and also there's the instruction book so maybe i'm going to go in it and see because i thought that i could touch this and you know change the setting but i can't so i have to go in your in the manual book and see what it's all about if anything goes wrong with this one so yeah but i'm super excited to use this already so yeah i'm going to clean i'm going to put a montage or time lapse with some background music because of course it's going to be a little bit boring you know i'm going to just put some music over it and leave the spirit a little bit in the room you ain't making money like we no done no done no watching asha my girl i know you're watching this shout out shout out i love your vlogs by the way so aesthetic so yeah it's so aesthetic and pleasing i love it love the vibe <laughs> you know i feel like i'm talking to you in those vlogs i can relate so much so yes if you're not subscribed to asha make sure to subscribe to her channel our vibes i love the vibes girl keep on doing you boo i love it and uh, what else oh i'm done gluing the fridge i situate the few things that i had in the fridge you like just like this for now and as i was going to go in the uh, manual book i noticed that they also it also comes with a you know the egg separation thingy so that's really good i don't have to buy one i thought at first that i have to buy my own one but no it has its own so what is this it also have this but i don't know what it is but you know i'll keep it maybe it will come handy one day i don't know and this is the acting in um so in my fridge let me bring you up close ow when we head to the grocery store i will situate everything i'll try to you know keep my fridge a little bit organized so i can show you a little bit how i keep my fridge organized and also you know maybe i can come up with ideas so you can also try them at home if you're you know into organization things keeping your things all aesthetically pleasing and organized if you're that type of people we can relate so i'll try to do that um the fridge is getting cold already my freezer it's already getting icy so that's a good thing i don't know if you can really see but maybe the sound do you see it's getting a little bit icy already so that's really good and in the back it's sweating do you see it's already sweating because it's getting cold and i have the door open the whole time so yeah and so this is the situation for now and for here i will be putting all my drinks here i don't know because i maybe you know overstack my drinks and i have to put them there we don't know here i don't know yet what i'm going to put here and here is going to be only for my skincare things but if you have other ideas where i can put these things let me know because i think it's not that the best option to put all your skincare things open like this in the fridge maybe in a ziplock but if you have another recommendation or 
something else that I can put them in and make it, you know, look a little bit more put together. That will be great. So let me know. So, yeah, that's all we have for now. Let me put you here for a minute. I hope you can see me again. I'm just going to go real quick into the uh, manual. Let me just put this here. Let me clean it real quick. And I'm also enjoying my Starbucks as I was cleaning. This is the, I think it's called the Iced Maple Caramel Latte. I don't know. I'm not really, it's not bad, but I'm not really a fan of it. And it also has like chunks of peanuts. I think it's peanuts in it. And that really kills the whole vibe. So I have two cups. I separated them and i filter this one so i don't get the nuts in it and it's better like this but it's not my favorite one but it's not bad though it's you know it's decent so yeah when i'm done doing this i have to um contact pasta now okay so my phone died on me i don't even remember what i was talking about but um I finished with my fridge right now i'm just you know organizing a little bit in the house because it's very chaotic in here chaotic 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 <laughs> it's very chaotic okay um in here so i'm organizing my things a little bit clean a little bit in here i'm going to fold also my clothes um i have the cardboards that i have to throw away and also my garbage bag so they're here waiting for me bomocha <laughs> and this situation here this is my mom's so she's going to bring that away of course um these clothes i'm going to um give them away to people in need that's a um oblast bath i don't know what you, how you say it in english and these are also um are the bottles that i have to hand in back so i can get money um so yeah i have to find a situation for that because um i still have like two bottles that i have to empty before i deliver all of these and i think by the 30 of this month i will be deliver them i will be delivering them to get my money or when I go grocery shopping this week, I will definitely be grocery um do some grocery shopping because I don't have nothing in my fridge. So maybe tomorrow or the next the day after that. Um, my clothes still waiting for me over there. So that's also will be folded folded. And yes, that's everything for today, I guess. So we have so much things to do today. So let's get started oh we already started so let's keep on doing our thing and oh and also an update of the package i can't chat with them online so i have to call them so i will be doing that when i'm done i'm throwing away the garbage and the cardboards and uh, so we can situate the whole packaging thing so yeah it's a whole lot of things to do today. We're super productive today. This will be, I think, a super productive and also fun week with Coco. So, <laughs> okay, so I have an update of the package. So I contacted um, Postenal and they told me that the package was already returned in one week of arriving here. So when it went to the shop, um, it stayed there for one week and then they shipped it out but somehow I got the mailing too late so the card or I saw it too late and it was already returned so in this case I can do nothing I had to contact the brand which I did so I told them about the whole situation and hopefully they can you know return it back <laughs> so we can still do this collaboration because it's some exciting collaboration and i really wanted this package so bad unfortunately we can't do much in this case so we just have to wait mm, what else oh and also in the meantime when i was done with pasta now 
I had to, you know, call up some places, um, you know, get some things done, arrange some things here and there that was supposed to be, you know, arranged. So, yeah, it was a little bit of calling here and there. But, yes, we are done with that. Right now, I think I'm just going to start by editing these footages because it's starting to be a lot of footages already. And we're still on Wednesday. So, there's a lot more days to go. Tomorrow, I'm not sure if it's going to... Um... Did you hear that? My stomach is like, Coco, we are hungry over here, girl. Let's eat. Yes, for tomorrow, so Thursday, I have a meeting with a girl of a podcast. Um, she still had to confirm with me if we're going to do it tomorrow or not. So be pending also for that podcast. And for Friday, I have to meet with two other friends. So maybe tomorrow, we will make sure or we will, yeah, we we will discuss it tomorrow for sure if we're going to go out on Friday. So if we're going out, of course, I will bring you all along and have some fun time together. And for the weekends, I don't have nothing planned exactly yet. Maybe I'll just finish editing the vlog, of course. And I think next week, I have another appointment or it's not an appointment but i have to meet up with a super great team for a photo shoot so we have a lot on the table we're getting busy there the influencer lifestyle is hitting home and also oh yes on the weekend or maybe today i don't know meanwhile the videos are rendering I'll start by sending some emails to some brands that I want to reach out to. And yeah, that's a little bit of catching up with Coco. So yeah, I'm just going to hop in and do some business. Handle this, start by editing this vlog so we can be up on time. Oh, and also the most exciting part, I'm going to drop two videos this week. So the vlog will be up first. And the other video, I think I will be um, getting it out on Friday this week so the week that you're watching it so if today it's monday then on friday you can expect another video of me making three different pinterest meals so i'll make breakfast lunch and dinner so i'm super excited i also have to go to the grocery store this week so we can do this for friday so be better for that i'm so 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 excited I still have to search up which type of meals I want to make. I'm not going to make something too complicated, you know, basic, but also so exotically pleasing so I can take pictures, you know, here and there. So be banning for Friday also for that video because I know a lot of y'all voted for this and was waiting for this video. So it will be out soon on Friday. <laughs> okay. So yes, I'm good. just going to handle the rest of the things. And I also planned my week. Maybe I'm try I'm just remembering all the things that I have to do this week. But I think before I do all those other things, I'm going to plan everything on my laptop. Because I'm a master at forgetting things. So I'm going to do a planning right now. And then after that, we'll be doing the editing looking up meals and all that thing i will fill y'all in on all of that so i'm super excited and i know you're excited too nice to meet you para laba para laba para laba Dito visa mi ma bai su tras Mi lagi ko lebro mi filtre mas Se koki parito nda confio mas Da ten quarentena de un guerra mas Ya mi dizembo da busca mi passa Se ando con avali no se da Da loro va primo de antica Da pega mi pito na mal arma Sunta mo ve dro Sunta mo ve arma Sunta pa ti bala Da papa no a su cara Sunta pa ve tra Cansaba yo da su mama Preocupa con nada Rigo un dia tu gota pasa Sunta mo ve droga 
okay i think it took me like one hour one and a half hour i guess i don't know i lost track of the time but i'm done with my planning for this month right yes i'm done with my plan for this month for this month <laughs> yes um i'm just going to show you how my planning consists of so i use um google calendar this is super handy you can also download it download it on your phone and connect it on your phone so i just added everything on my laptop and then um check everything up on my phone so um to start the week i'm going to explain because i know you're like what's all of this i'm going to explain i'll try to explain it because i made it the way that i understand but of course you won't understand if you have your own so every day from monday till sunday i have a morning love which is my let's say morning routine so i wake up have breakfast and take a bath so everything that consists of the usual morning routine of a normal person and that starts from 7 till 8 30. i it's not it won't exactly go like that maybe i can finish earlier than that never know but you know i just point it out there maybe i can wake up later that day never know how tired i am but you know just to have a view of my day and then for Coco Glow, this means like I have it twice a week, if you see here and here. So for Coco Glow, it's like my facial routine. So I take, let's say, a few hours off, you know, just to relax, do a facial, you know, because it's so important for the self-care routine. So let's say the Coco Glow is a self-care routine. Yes, this is only half like 30 minutes and on saturday i have more time so it won't it will be longer than monday and the gr the two greens one is create content and the other one is added content which i do twice a week create content and added content it also can vary depending on the mood if i'm really in the mood some days i will shoot content days after days after days it really depends on the mood but i put wednesday standard for me to edit content and saturday if i have to finish some editing so it will be uploaded on time for my monday uploads and also i want to start with two uploads per week but i still have to look into that because i have to start with internship and with internship i don't know how it's going to go because i have to go from internship i have to attend internship from monday till saturday and also it depends on the timing of my internship so this also will be changing when i have an internship so yeah at one and at two it's just a reminder to have lunch because i don't um eat lunch often and my body tells me every time like girl you need to at least have you know something on every Tuesday and Thursday, I have classes. I didn't apply this right here because um, it's already Wednesday. So on every Tuesday and Thursday, I have classes till I have an internship. And that's only a meeting catching up how it's going with the internship interviews and everything. And what else do I have? From exercise, I exercise four times a week. It's a home exercise, so I don't go to the gym or nothing yet. So I just go to take a walk in my neighbor and exercise indoors. And later that day, I have, of course, dinner. And night love is just like preparing myself to go to sleep, you know, hanging on my laptop or watching some TikToks, watching vlogs and all of that. And for this week, I also have right up here laundry, but I did laundry already, so I don't have to do that anymore. And for Tuesday, I have grocery, which is tomorrow. I have to do some grocery shopping and also um, more in the afternoon. I have to, I have a meeting, but still I'm waiting on a confirmation of that. And Friday at four, I have a girl's day out with my friends and every Saturday, yes, every Saturday, it's every Saturday? No, on 
25 of each month i have budget for the month so it's just a reminder to budget my um finances for that month and make all the payments so i can have you know a better view of what i can spend and what i cannot so that's my calendar real quick um yeah it's really you know it looks a little bit here and there, but I do recommend Google Calendar if you want to plan everything out, especially being an influencer, a student, soon going to an internship and all of that, planning collaboration and all those, you really need a planner. And this comes in so handy. If you do a job that also requires you to plan your day, especially as a student, you just have to be a student, you have to plan everything out here. So... I really recommend Google Calendar if y'all want a separate video on how I make everything. Let me know and then I'll show y'all how you can, you know, many over, you know, go along with all the planning of the calendar, play with the colors and all of that. So let me know and then I'll make a separate video about that. So finally I'm done. <laughs> um... I had something planned else for today. So I'm supposed to go do some exercise right now, but I'm not going because I have to post a picture right now. So I'm going to finish editing that, post it, and then I recall something else that I had to do for today and I don't even remember. Do you see? I am a master at forgetting things i don't know if it's alzheimer or not i don't know i'm too young for this got to do it got to do with it baby yo dj then got to do it got to do with it baby so today, as we are in Rotterdam, I'm with one of my friends. Hi, girl. She looking fine. <laughs> we just managed taking some pictures. This is my outfit for today. I'm wearing green, Sarah, and with my sneakers. You can really see, but anyway, let's cross. <laughs> um, we are going to do some shopping, and then we are going to get something to eat, have some cocktail, you know have a girls day out and we have to wait like half an hour for another friend so you guys will see her in a few minutes um, Baby, let you know from the gate. I don't go down, lady. I want a chick with dick hips that licks the lips. She could be the office site or like
trip again and again and again the party must continue right <laughs> so yes we are heading to a party but s sorry for the sound you know i'm in the train so you know like mm -hmm, i can't do much about that so i'll try to speak a little bit more loud um so we are heading to almera i'm going to visit my second mom's family her niece birthday is today and I didn't saw her in like years I swear it's been like I think I don't even recall how many years I think like 10 years already and since I came to live in an island I also didn't go to visit them so this will be a fun celebration for her and also you know our reunion thing going on I'm so excited to see her I don't know if she knows that I'm coming but me and her brother planned this whole thing for me to come so I'm going to meet her brother at the station in Almera and so we can head there together so I'll try to record and also you know I'm not going to put the camera in everybody's face because I don't know how everybody feels about that and also you know I want to have some good quality time but it's also a celebration so I want to fit y'all in so maybe I'll do like a few shots here and there you know about the whole celebration so yes um, sorry that I didn't show y'all my outfit maybe I'll let the brother when I get to the station I'll let them you know record me to show y'all my outfit but I'm just wearing monochromatic um, brown shades today. So monochromatic is basically um, when you're wearing one specific color in every shade. And yeah, so I'm in brown shades today. <laughs> um, my jacket is brown. My purse is brown. I have a beige color um, shirt. And also I have these pants zebra pants with my white sneakers and I love it and also of course you know my shade is also brown so we popping we popping <laughs> oh and by the way let me put you on this drink I heard good reviews I heard good things about this drink that it tastes so delicious and at first I was like a little bit turned off by the color and I'm like mm, I don't know about that if I want to you know pay for that and don't end up liking it but i swear it tastes so good it's so delicious it's a must try and of course i will be buying it often but you don't get it everywhere because it's so sold really fast but remember coco put you on that so go try yours so yeah i'll meet y'all at almeida <laughs>